Well, as many of you already know, our province has a relatively few number of fishable lakes. So when there is an opportunity to rehabilitate a lake to bring it back to a fishable condition, I think that's something to celebrate. What lake am I talking about? Let's go outdoors and find out more. Historically, Hassey Lake, located just outside Stony Plain, has been a popular fishing spot, but it's been a long time since these fish cleaning stations have been used. Still, people make the trip out in hopes of spending some quality time with family. I know for the kids, they look forward to days out like this, especially all of our grandchildren are city kids, so bringing them to the country and giving them a day out and letting them have some fun and hopefully catching something would be wonderful. In order to determine what has led to the demise of the fish stocks, the Alberta Conservation Association has started a multi-year program to study the lake. Today we're out setting some gill nets and some minnow traps and uh, that's all to assess the fishery that's remaining here at Hassey Lake. And uh, really it's just uh, two methods that we use to find out what fish uh, are there. The next day, the nets are pulled, and it becomes pretty clear the only fish remaining in this lake are various species of minnows. So the big question is, what can be done to bring this lake back? To help on that front, a leading expert in lake aeration has been brought in. It seems to be in the, in the size range, surface area-wise and depth-wise, that's probably amenable to using lake aeration or oxygenation as a technique to get enough oxygen in the lake so you can have game fish in it. Aeration is only part of the solution. Controlling the nutrients seeping into the lake remains a larger issue and will have to be contained if there's going to be a chance for large game fish to survive and for anglers like the Holter family to return to Hassey Lake. So it's all about creating more fishing opportunities and I think having a lake like Hassey Lake so close to major metropolitan areas is great for a number of reasons. Of course, makes it easy for folks to get out and enjoy an evening of fishing. That's also easy to get uh, younger people more engaged in angling as it's not a big drive to get out to a, a, a further lake and that type of thing. And of course, it being stocked, well, that's a big positive. Now, as to Hassey Lake and the schedule for its, um, I guess, reintroduction into, uh, into the fishing uh, ledger, uh, that is still a bit of an unknown. Uh, the ACA and the province are working through details as to when uh, fish can be stocked into that lake, uh, possibly sometime in the coming year. And of course, just another reminder, uh, we are in strange times and uh, to practice that physical distancing when you are out and about. But uh, hey, um, can't think of a better way to get out and, and have some uh, alone time, and that is maybe throwing a line into a lake, a river, or a stream. Do take care out there, everyone. And uh, till next time, I'm Michael Short. Let's go outdoors.